In this example, we're going to work through and find the exact value for the tangent of 67.5 degrees. And we're going to do so by employing this half angle identity for tangent. And there are a few choices here for this half angle identity, and I went ahead and went with 1 minus the cosine x divided by the sine of x. And so it looks like to get started, we're trying to find 67.5 degrees. So I need some angle x that when I cut it in half, I get 67.5. So that's going to be 135 degrees. So I can say the tangent of 135 degrees over 2, and then we can use this half angle identity. So it'll be 1 minus the cosine of that 135 degrees all divided by that sine of 135 degrees. And this is great because we know both of these values. So let's get started. 1 minus, and then the cosine of 135 degrees, is a negative square root of 2 over 2. And the sine of 135 degrees is positive square root of 2 over 2. Well, let's look to simplify. We'll start with the numerator. We are subtracting a negative, so let's do a little swoosh swoosh there, and we will make that an, into an addition problem. And then this 1, we can turn it into a 2 over 2, that way we have common denominators. So we'll have 2 plus the square root of 2 all over that 2. And of course that's going to be over that denominator. Okay, so now we have ourselves this complex fraction. So let's go ahead and multiply by the reciprocal of the denominator. So it'll be 2 over the square root of 2, which is really nice because those 2's will cancel. And I'm left then with 2 plus the square root of 2 all divided by the square root of 2. Well, let's break this addition problem up into two separate fractions. Of course, each one having this common denominator. So we'll do this in an effort to simplify things a little bit more. Okay, so 2 divided by the square root of 2. Well, that's just going to be the square root of 2. And then, of course, the square root of 2 divided by the square root of 2 will be 1. So it looks like we have the square root of 2 plus 1. So I'm going to go ahead and write the tangent of 67.5 degrees equals the square root of 2 plus 1. So let's go ahead and grab a calculator and just ensure that works. Okay, so here's our calculator, and we'll just move things up a little bit and make some room. So we'll use the inverse tangent here. So inverse tangent of, and then we'll just put this ratio in here, the square root of 2 plus 1. And this is 135 over 2, or, yeah, 67.5 degrees. So we can see here that this is going to be the exact value for the tangent of 67.5 degrees, and we found that by using this half angle identity for tangent.